It's World Kidney Day and chronic kidney disease is on the rise in Cayman. To combat the so-called silent killer, the Health Services Authority hosted free screenings for members of the public this morning. Cayman 27's Joe Avery reports. About 12 years ago, we had about 20-something patients on dialysis. But today, we have up to 64 to 65 patients on dialysis. Dr. Nelson Ine Onunehu, better known as simply Dr. Nelson, says this threefold increase is alarming given Cayman's population. For a population of 60,000, that is a significant amount of people who are on dialysis and also have transplant. So it is quite Come on. Nurses in here make you very comfortable. Dialysis has kept Shelly Miles alive for almost nine years. She says those with risk factors for chronic kidney disease shouldn't wait for next year's World Kidney Day to get screened. There's a lot of people, especially in Cayman, there is a lot of people that should be in here and they're not here. And they should be more screenings done. Dr. Nelson says risk factors include high blood pressure, diabetes, cholesterol problems, and family history of chronic kidney disease. He says chronic kidney disease is sometimes called the silent killer because by the time symptoms present themselves, the disease is in its late stages. Early detection of chronic kidney disease offers you the opportunity to see whether you can reverse the kidney disease or you know, at best, slow the progression to end stage. I'm supposed to be on a list, but, you know, it takes time. As Ms. Miles continues the long wait for a transplant, she shared her best advice for those who may not know their numbers. Go and get checked as soon as possible. You never know. Joe Avery, Cayman 27. The HSA says 62 people took advantage of this morning's free World Kidney Day screenings. That's down from last year's numbers when 100 patients were screened. And Joe will be back later in the show with a check on your weather.